Hey, what's happening gamers? It's Kaywin here, and yes, my long hair is gone. Ow, that actually hurt my neck now. <laughs> and I'm back to my traditional haircut and stuff like that. Anyway, uh, if you guys will notice, on the side over there is the TMNT 3 co-op review. Now, that actually was finished on Thursday night, but I wanted to add the return of Kane Ninja, so that's why he appears in the live action stuff and why the video didn't release until yesterday. I was also trying to get a better version of the TMNT 3 review up on Screw Attack in high definition, but uh, something happened with the file size and I'm already up to like 500 views on the video, so there's no point really taking it down. Although the high definition version is on Blip TV. So if you guys could head over and watch that video, that would be awesome. And again, uh, remember that by clicking the link and seeing my videos for free on Blip TV, you guys are supporting me. Now, <clears throat> I don't usually do this, but I have a little rant to get off my chest. For my birthday, I got the HD minicam of Vido from uh, my wife for my birthday, and it was supposed to be how K-Wing Reviews was going to do high definition. The camera worked once. It charged all the way up, and we were able to do the K-Ninja green screen stuff, and the camera broke. So <laughs> that's why I'm not doing the K-Vlog, which is the new name of the, the vlog. Thanks to uh, K-Wing team members over at the forum site. You guys rock, as always. So the HD minicam is broken. So what this means for my new show for Screw Attack and also my new retro gaming show, I have no idea. Because until I'm able to film in high definition, I don't know how that's going to work. So we're just going to have to hope and pray that the camera gets back to me and fix so we can get this up and running. Now, uh, Mondays are actually going to officially be my day off. And the reason is because I want to spend time with my wife and also there's a new Chuck on. And I've been waiting uh, almost three weeks for a brand new Chuck. And uh, some of you know that I actually went and bought the second season a while ago. And my wife and I watched the entire season. Like two days, we just watched it straight. It was awesome! Love I also have a new job that I will be doing for a company that's been around since 1996. They are a very popular gaming site. It's not IGN or GameSpot, and I'm going to leave the guessing game to that. The contract isn't finalized, but I will be doing something that doesn't have to do with video reviews. It's actually something that I kind of did for Blue Lightning Productions, where I did voiceover work, and I will be doing a variety of videos for that site, about 6 to 10, maybe even 15 a month. Uh, what this means for Got Game and Game Nights, I don't know, but I will be paid very well. And that's a good thing. And the video site gets like millions of views, so you'll see my popularity go. So that's that's going to be really cool, and I'm, I'm very thankful for this opportunity. I will also be doing some very cool work with Screw Attack that I really can't let the cat out of the bag just yet, because Craig and I are still going over the specifics and things like that. But the new show will be exclusive to Screw Attack, but also some big things are happening with the site. And uh, I hope you guys will stay tuned, and hopefully it will be the new home for the K-Wing Review Season 4, and also the new show in development and some other things, but not the stuff I do for God Game and some other people. That's completely different. Uh, I also have some sad news today. The state where I live um, wants me to focus, since I did create a business about uh, gaming reviews and gaming critics and things like that, I have an obligation to the state to finish the project I start. And the project that I'm, of course, talking about is the DVD. So, that means that the fourth season, after the Turtles series is over, will be going on hiatus for some time. And I will be finishing up the DVD that's been in production forever. So we can get that sold and I won't be in trouble with the uh, local government for starting a business and not really... Uh, taking my obligations seriously, so to avoid lawsuits and other things, um, I need to finish that project. But I know a lot of you are excited about the DVD that's coming out. It will have the... the DVD that we're doing first is actually the Greatest Hits volume, and it will be seasons one through four with uh, selected episodes that people say were their favorite, and you guys voted for it, and it should be really, really cool. Also, there will be a new video on there exclusive to the DVD that, of course, is Eternal Darkness. 
Also, Chris Holen and I will be buckling our belt, so to speak, to finish the game covers album. K-Wife has actually written some new original music, and we will be working very hard on this project. And my drum set is actually going to be right there, there, right behind me. So uh, Chris and my wife and I are going to be working very hard on the album, and it should release in the fall. We have a couple tracks left to finish, and it will be on sale for about $13.99 on iTunes. And uh, it will have original music, and it will also have uh, some game cover stuff. The album was originally going to be 26 tracks, but we've actually moved those other tracks onto our second album, which will release eventually. But the first one is what we're going to be working on right now. And um, I think that's going to wrap up my uh, cave vlog. I didn't really have anything interesting to say other than announcements today, but... Um, I also don't know when the Game Nights uh, radio show is going to commence. On Monday I have to go in for blood work for cholesterol and blood pressure. So I'm not going to be the happiest camper to do a radio show on Monday morning uh, because I hate needles. But um, I also will be working on the Dante's Inferno review and also the Tournament Fighters. And Tournament Fighters will be ready by March and so should Turtles in Time. So, you guys have a lot to look forward to. I also did a cameo in Swag's newest review for Dragon Age, which will release eventually. And I hope you guys will enjoy. This has been another cave vlog. Uh, take the time to head over to Screw Attach, the newest TMNT co op review. If you guys are big uh, Turtles fans, then I think you will love this episode. And also, K Ninja makes a cameo. So, those of you who petition to see K Ninja return, you got your wish. As always, guys, have a safe week. This is K-Wing, as always, saying God bless, God bless, and happy gaming. Until the next K-Vlog, this is K-Wing saying, see you, gamers.